Hi everyone, welcome to this video about the new updates in my latest Second Brain 5.0 version. In this quick video, we'll go over what I've changed in the newest version of my Notion template. So, let's get started. I've recently created a dark mode version of the covers database for each dashboard. Now, the dashboard perfectly complements the dark mode. To enable it, simply access the cover property and switch the light cover with the dark cover. The image at the top will automatically appear on the dashboard. Notion has released a new feature to streamline your workflow. You can now update a property with just a click using a button in the corresponding area. This allows you to customize your Notion dashboard by adding buttons for a more efficient workflow. The template can be synced with the Notion Calendar app. To do this, access the database you need to sync and click on Open in Calendar. You'll then be able to customize your plans within your Notion Calendar system. Use the Notion Calendar to see if there are any other plans that align with these. First, create a new free account, which allows you to create one free chart. Then, select the corresponding database from your workspace. Be sure to choose the correct X and Y axis to display your data. In both the standard and premium versions of this template, you'll find a ready-to-use database named Chart Reporting, so you just need to follow the property names to sync it. <laughs> 